Hey what's up guys, it's my Tech HD here back with another video. So in this video I'm going to be showing you the most coolest and the fun Fortnite season 4 glitches. And also these glitches are only for fun and these will not give you any advantage over the game. So the first glitch is with the Thor's skin. What you want to do is you want to go to your locker and change your skin to Thor. Once you're in Thor and you also want Thor's hammer as your pickaxe. Once you got your Thor skin and your Thor pickaxe, you want to go and start your game you can play any team rumble solos or squads you can do this in any of the matches and what you want to do is you want to uh, come to any spot in the map it doesn't matter where you are uh, once you are there start uh, building a wall just build a wall and once you have the wall you want to go into the edit mode before that you want to use this emote uh, the god of thunder emote to change to this uh, lightning silver thor whatever it's called so now what you want to do is you want to go inside the edit mode you do not want to go inside the edit mode when you're in the building mode uh, you want to go to the edit mode with your pickaxe so you want to start doing this as fast as you can start going into the edit mode and release the edit mode as fast as you can and once you do that you can see that the pickaxe is glowing this was before and after and wait for it it's only very little when you keep doing this i did this like a lot of time as you can see i did this like it just took me like what solid 10 minutes and after that you actually have a glowing pickaxe you can't even see the doors hammer it just glows in your hand just like that it's very very noticeable and if the enemy players or someone notices it they're definitely going to be confused about what sort of pickaxe is this in fortnite so as you can see it's really really glowing a lot and uh i want him to just wait he, he doesn't even give a shit he can't even see this properly dude just please okay it looks like he doesn't give a shit okay there's an enemy okay, let's see if i can actually show him Hey, dude, you want to look at... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. He just... He just... Damaged me. Dude, look at me. Look at my pickaxe. Look at my pickaxe. It's glowing. See? He can definitely see me in his screen. I don't know. He's not reacting. Okay. He just killed him. Dude, you don't have to kill him. Oh, enemy. Dude, dude, you want to look at my pickaxe? Wow. Okay. Never mind. Okay, moving on to the next glitch. The next glitch is actually a really good one. I actually like this glitch. What you want to do is you want to go to the Dooms domain. And for this glitch, you want to go next to the Vault. You can do this in any of the uh, solo squads or duos. This is not a glitch. This is actually a trick. So you need you need 20 mats to actually build some ramp. You want to come to this exact spot and build two ramps over here. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be going to this spot over here, which is directly next to the Vault and is an amazing amazing secret hiding spot so before you go to that spot you can actually stay on this over here and break the ramp that you just built and you actually stay over there you can also use this spot to actually just stay there secretly and to actually get to that spot which is the best spot in doom's domain which is next to the wall you want to break this side part over here not the main part the side part once you break it uh, okay, I just fell down. I need to go up again and just let me just build the ramp as fast as possible. Yeah, and you want to just slide inside. You want to crouch and you want to slide in. And there you go. Yes, I actually got in. Okay, and you can just break the ramp that you just built. And over here, if you're here, no one is going to literally spot you over here. They're not even going to look at you because it's totally hidden. And from below, it's going to look like there's no space on top to stay. So as you can see, you can just shoot them as soon as they come next to the vault. Uh, keep a sniper rifle or even a revolver one shot and they've just did one headshot and as you can see if i go to the zen and if i do an emote half of my body is hidden so this is a great spot to hide and actually eliminate those who actually come to the uh, vault they will definitely have the mythic weapons and you also get the amazing mythic weapons in this season so as you can see from below it's it the people are going to hide over here or they're going to be hiding over there usually for to conquer the vault but now we have this extra secret place on top from below even from next to the vault you can definitely not spot them at all so it's that good so you can use this spot when you're playing also guys go ahead and comment down below which one was your favorite glitch on season 4 and moving on to the next glitch for this glitch we need a crash pad so I'm gonna go ahead and find some crash pads. It's crash pads are usually inside the chests. It's definitely a little hard to find because not all the chests have the crash pads. So I'll have to go ahead and take a look at each and every chest. Mm, hopefully this time I get a crash pad. We just need one crash pad. So uh, hopefully there is crash pad. Yes, I got the crash pad. Okay, amazing. 
So I have three crash pads now, and for this glitch, you need a car. You need any sort of car. So, oh shit, I just used one by mistake. Damn it, oh shit. Okay, so moving on to the video. So you need a car. All right, so now we have a car, finally. So what you want to do is, uh, you're going to be using your crash pad. Now, as you can see, if I use the crash pad right like this, okay, oops. Oh, no, no, oh shit. Okay, I just used the crash pad once again. Damn it. Okay, you just wanna keep the crash pad like this and break it. And once you're in this part on the car over here, you start jumping. <laughs> yes, it actually works like a crash pad. So once you're there, you just jump just like that. Even though the crash pad is not there, you could actually use this car as a crash pad. And def I think if you move this part of the car, it's not going to work. Let me just check it out. So, okay, wait. Uh, uh, no, it doesn't work. So it looks like it doesn't work in any other spot. Uh, this is just a fun glitch. This doesn't give you any advantage over the game. So it only works in the spot where the car was when you're using the crash pad. So that is this glitch. So we're going to be moving on to the next glitch. So now the next glitch is in the Coral Castle. So you want to come to this exact spot in the Coral Castle. So this is the exact spot as I've marked in the location right next to this. So once you're in the exact spot that I look marked, uh, you want to come to the edge of this waterfall over here just a second so over here you just want to come to this edge and this only works in this spot in coral castle right over here this doesn't work any other place in the map you want to come here and what you want to do is you want to just uh, crouch you just want to crouch and look inside the water and it's going to be so clean inside the water yes this is exactly how it's going to look and this glitch is still there this doesn't work anywhere else only except this spot in the coral castle so this is a really cool glitch you can just go ahead and you can actually see all the fishes and everything inside so clear way more clear than it is outside so usually underwater doesn't look like this underwater when you go underwater it's going to look like this so it's going to be like this but only at that exact spot in coral castle it works so guys if this video was interesting do give it a thumbs up and moving on to the next glitch of this video the next glitch is next to the steamy stacks we want to come to this exact position next to the steamy stacks it's in the pond right there you just have, don't have to do anything you just have to land there once you land there you're gonna go underwater just like that <laughs> yes you are underwater in fortnite season 4 so once you're underwater you can even go next to these fishes and just say a hi to the fishes and you could you you would have never seen a fish underwater this close wow these glitches are so fun to do you can just stay here and i think i'm not sure let me just try to uh, go a little further and see if he stays underwater if I slowly move underwater, I think at a point he's just going to like start swimming. Let me just try to slowly go. Okay, there you go. So it does not work except for that spot over there. There is a bar barrier, I think. There is a bar which you cannot exceed. So you can definitely just walk over here and he's just going to start walking underwater. So this is the glitch over here next to the steamy stacks. So this is going to be fun to do and it's, it's so cool to look at you just underwater. So guys, for this next glitch, you want to be Thor once again. You want to have the Thor skins because we need the Thor's hammer and only Thor can use the Thor's hammer. You want to get inside any of the match and what you want to do is you want to lower your effects and processing to low. So the post processing and effects change it to low and click on apply this only works on pc now uh, once you are inside the match now once you're here you need to change to the silver uh, thor so once you use that emote and change to the silver thor as the effects and post processing are low and once you swing the pickaxe you're supposed to get a wavy effect wait i'm actually not getting it i think i'll have to change the settings once again so it's not quite working right now uh, just a second let me just go back to the settings and check one more time so so go to your settings and in the graphics quality so let me just increase the effects to epic so something will trigger oh uh, there you go there you go you oh my god look at that this actually stays for a while so you can just swing your hammer swing your pickaxe just like that and these effects are going to stay on the screen just like that you can just show your friends and it'll be really really cool this glitch is a really really fun one oh my god did you see that there's like so many of these over here oh shit you can just keep on doing this these will definitely fade away after a few seconds because these are just effect glitches this post processing stuff so <laughs> that is a fun glitch over there 
So moving on to the next glitch in this glitch, you want to be as Jennifer Walters. So we all know Jennifer Walters has these spectacles, these glasses she's wearing. You want to go into the creative, launch creative. And I don't know why for some reason this is a fun glitch. This is a very small glitch. And what we are actually going to do in this glitch is we are going to remove Jennifer Walters glasses. So as you can see, she has these huge glasses on her face, which on my opinion doesn't look good. You want want to emote you just don't want to do the normal emote you want this gamma overload emote which she will change to heal and now we're going to change back to jennifer waters and in between the emote just move aside and you can see that her glasses are gone She's not wearing glasses anymore. She's just Jennifer Walters without glasses. And now she just looks way more better, way more better than she wearing glasses. If you want to look in the front, uh, you can do this transverse emote. So as you do this transverse emote, you, she's going to turn to the side of the camera. So as you can see, she looks way much better. She looks so beautiful without those glasses. So now this is a really, really small glitch, which you can use to actually show your friends. That is all. Those were all the glitches on the season four these are really fun and exciting to do you can go ahead and try each and one of these so if you enjoyed this video give this a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel for more fortnite tips and tricks and i will see you in the next video